Hello, and welcome to a discussion about how cognitive therapy can help you to ease issues of anxiety and depression and deal with those clouds that come to us. It shines a little light through those clouds that we all experience. The reality is, is cognitive therapy helps us to see what is true about our thinking. We have 70,000 thoughts a day that come into our minds upon, on average, and we need to sort through all that. And what helps us to sort that through is our emotions. So at times our emotions are very high. We might experience a lot of anger. We might experience a lot of sadness. And that, that then shows us that we need to deal with that thought. And when we look at the thoughts, we can see that possibly they may not be true at all. And we need to take time to spend a little while to put our thoughts on trial. And this is what I teach my clients to do. So sometimes a thought is completely untrue, sometimes a thought is partially true, and sometimes the thought is completely true. So if a thought is completely true, you have two options. You can either develop an action plan and do something about it, or you need to accept the fact that this particular thing in your life just is not that pleasant. But if a thought is a complete lie, for an example, you may feel that you're worthless. So what does that mean if you feel that you're worthless? Well, really, you can't define what worthlessness is. Really, our sense of worth comes from something much deeper, which is in our spirit. Okay, so it's an unmeasurable. So worthlessness is really a symptom of depression. It doesn't have anything to do with a true thought. It is a feeling. So we need to look at thoughts and make sure that they're true, especially if they're affecting us deeply. So I've been spending a long, long time, I was one of the first people in my local area to do cognitive therapy. This is back 25 years ago. And I have found that it has been an effective approach in helping people to have a more contented life.